Hello, my friends, and welcome back to our blind let's play Sky of Arcadia Legends. My name is Flyers Burr, this is our Storybase Gaming channel, and if you've been following live with us, you know I've been gone for a couple days. If you're watching this in the future, well, you're not going to hardly notice, but uh, my health has improved. I don't know what happened to me. It's like I go to work and I get home and I'm so tired, I just can't do anything. And that's been happening to me the last few days, just I, no energy at all to do... You know, to do the things that I want to do. But I'm excited to be back here. And we are on a way to save Ika from being uh, uh, assaulted in various unpleasant ways. Uh, so let's go do that, shall we? I think we made her wait long enough. Shame on us for doing that. But let's go save Ika today, shall we? Alright, so we got Vice and Gilder, and we're finding some yellow officers, and uh, I had a new chart that I pulled up online, and I forgot to write it down, so I don't know what the chart is. Uh, let's see, um, it was really good, because I found a chart that says, uh, if the color is this, then attack with this, and it made it, like, very clear on what to do, uh, so I need to go find that, but I think, uh, if they're yellow... Um, at the yellow, you attack with green or silver? Maybe? Counter stance. Well, that's unfortunate. Oh, one has a counter stance and one is guarding. Huh. Very interesting enemies we got here. Uh, let's go ahead and cut this for your one and then uh, do damage to the other one. Although what I probably could have done is use Gilder's move. Probably would have been more effective. But you know, I'm kind of rusty. It's been a couple of days. It's, yeah, I'm going to make mistakes. That one still died. Hope everyone's having a wonderfully fantastic day and a wonderful fantastic week. Uh, this video is going out Saturday, and I'm going to be spending the entire day with my family. So there's a good chance that there may not be a video on Sunday. Because tomorrow I'm going to be with my family from, easy. like, 10 in the morning to 9 at night. Uh, so needless to say, it's, uh, it's going to be an all-day affair. And I hate, I hate doing that because, I mean, we just started playing this game again. I have to be gone for a couple days, so I, I do ask for your forgiveness in that, and I ask for your understanding. Uh, you know, it, it wasn't my intention to not feel well, after all. Uh, an elevator switch. Prisoner block, fortress cannon room, don't get on the elevator. What's the other one say? It's the same thing, so let's go to the prisoner block. Obviously. I mean, come on. Not gonna go to the cannon first. Whew, all right, where are we at? Big open room. With enemies in it. Man, it's really unfortunate too, because I, I, I almost feel like this game has really picked up on, uh, on the story and everything, and just all the stuff that's going on. So I really miss, you know, playing this game. Poison gas. Ooh, that did some damage and it poisons probably. Yes, it does. That's going to do some additional damage as well. Well, you can't be poisoned twice. So if that was going to hit someone, although it would have been better if it hit Vice. That way I could have probably just uh, sacrumed. But I don't think uh, I had the ability to sacrum with this current party configuration. Uh, I don't think the gunslinger is going to hit this. But he's guarding, so it doesn't matter. This is such an awesome move. Does a ridiculous amount of damage. It shoots in a line. I mean, this is so OP in my opinion. Alright. 
Ah, uh, it was that poison damage ticking. It's pretty potent damage if you think about it, you know? 208 damage per round? That means that that ability basically did 400 damage to him and then 400 damage to him over two rounds. So it did 800 total of damage to him, which for a normal enemy is a lot of damage. <laughs> That's a lot of damage. Uh, let's go ahead and uh, I don't I know Sakura, unfortunately. Well, we got Sakura here. Yeah, that's fine. Now watch, we're gonna get attacked by a boss and I'm gonna be like, yeah, that's fine. Wait a second. Am I going back the way that I just came? Did we literally ride an elevator? No, okay, good. I was about to say that, That that is uh, Hey, Eka, do you want us to come back later? <laughs> Look at her face. Oh my, oh my God, what are you doing? Um, uh, dude, that's not cool. Vice, get this kid off of me. Hey, beat it, kid. Dude, you are one sick dude. Sorry to spoil your fun, but you heard the lady. Who said we were having fun? Yeah, that's disturbing right there. Like, really? I am Vigoro. No woman in Valua can resist me. I believe that the worth of a man can be measured by his popularity with a woman. Dude, you're not popular with woman. She's... She wants to kick you in the nuts. And so do I. Hmm. I kind of like that. I should remember that for later. Gilder, whose side are you on? Where's Fina? Give us back the crystals and bring Fina here. Fina, oh, the Silvite. Ramirez escorted her to the Imperial Palace. Is that so? Well, after we beat the Sat out of you, we'll be rescuing her. I love it when a woman talks tough. Let me give your friends a lesson in brute force. Hey, I've been wanting to kick this guy in the balls for a while now. Because you don't treat women that way. It's, it, it's, no, it's, it's, it's not cool. Okay, um. Kind of need to focus. Kind of need to focus. I know this is a little too, uh, passive, but. Oh, you, you punk. Not only did you backhand Aika, but you critted her too. God, I really wish we had Incremis by now. Would make life so much easier. Alright, um... Increm... On... Gilder. Increm on you. Uh, focus. We're gonna fight back in the next round, don't worry. I mean, this this uh, this whole first round was all about uh, just being ready for the fight. Too bad we don't have Fini here. No crit and a counter. All right, so he has a lot of life. Uh, let's see. I am hurting. I'm gonna do a normal attack. I'm gonna have you. Um, yeah, I'll have you soccer, and I'll have you just do a normal attack. I could have cut this feud with Vice, but I wanted to save that SP in case we need to heal. The gore is charm. Oh! Aika, I swear, if you get charmed. Oh, come on, Aika! Really? And unfortunately, she's super fast, too. So, I don't think we'll be able to uncharm her before, uh... Oh! Good job, Aika. She resisted its... She resisted his whatever you want to call whatever he was doing. Alright, uh, let's go ahead and do an all-out attack here. Oh, I forgot to look at element colors. 
Oh, that's a mistake. Well, at least we put him on his butt. Why is he countering attacking this with anyway? It's like burst of wind or something. All right, what element is he? We're doing good damage now. Uh, he is red, so we need to do purple. I'm pretty sure purple was the right color. Yeah, I think that's the right color. Show Moose Boss, Vice. Yeah! It's not too much more damage, but still more damage. Ah, oh, so close. And that did it. I was actually hoping I could get the final hit, but I couldn't control a counterattack. Hopefully, we never had to see that general again. Welcome back, Ika. A lot of purple magic there, and we got a cannon room key. Heh, looks like you were all talk. Now, in this defense, it is three against one. Grr, really, you got lucky. And, and, I didn't have my cannon or my armor. Uh, Pirate Isle, where I was raised, we have a saying. A true man never makes excuses for his shortcomings. And going by that saying, you got quite a ways to go. Ooh. Hey, you got an attitude. I like that. You'll be seeing me again. You can count on it. God, I hope not. You are my least favorite person in the game. I, I can't stand people who... I wish, I wish this was a... Uh, Ugh, that hurt, Red. I wish this was Silent Hill 3, where I could kick the enemies when they're on the ground. Because I just want to run into them and kick them like a thousand times. Like, right here, you know? Just, just right here, like a thousand times. Anyway. Let's move on, shall we? We got the cannon key, so we should be able to go to the cannon room. I know that sounds... Logically, duh, flightless bird. Yeah, yeah, I got you. I got you. All right, let's head. Actually, hmm, the switch isn't doing anything. This elevator is probably stuck on another floor, or somebody else may already be inside it. Let's sit, stick around to find out which, okay? Yeah, it's a good idea. But also, what I would like to do is I would like to get everyone healed up if I can. Uh, let's go to the Fortress Cannon Room, Battery 28. It would have been cool if the doors closed and then it panned to the right and showed show the other door open. Right, okay, well, that's what exactly happened. So, this is where the air pirates have been held. Yes, Prince Enrique. I like this guy. I, I will admit, he's, he's not a douche like the other characters in... The Empire. I wish to speak with them. Take me to them. Sir, perhaps it would be best for you to wait out here. The cell is not fitting for one of your stature. I'll get the other guards. We will bring the prisoner and we'll find find the prisoner and bring him to you. Hmm. Well, I'll finally get to meet the legendary air pirate face. If the rumor I've heard are true, he'll look like a demon and spit fire. But, my instincts are telling me that he's fighting for all the right reasons. Yeah, you see? I like this guy. Prince Enrique, it's an emergency. But I like how the Empire thinks we, like, breathe fire. That's kind of cool, too. I found Admiral Vigoro conscious of one of the cells. The rest of the cells are empty. It appears that Feist and the others have escaped. What? I see. They're trying to escape from the Grand Fortress again. Listen carefully. Do not tell anyone about this. Keep the doors to this area closed. Don't let anyone in or out. What? If you are questioned about it later, tell them that it was a direct order from me. Understand? 
Yes, your majesty, but... Very well, then. Good job. Stay here. There's an urgent matter that I must attend to. Is he helping us? I mean, I kind of like the guy even more now. Dude! I mean, he's not writing us out, you know? He's actually helping us escape. This looks like a heavily barred door. Use the cannon room key to open the door. Oh, this room looks cool. This looks like something out of Grandia. The, the original Grandia. Um, towards like the end of the game when uh, there was all the military ships and everything. Oh, hello. Are we literally going out of the cannon area? What the? This can's new and it's huge! This thing is big enough to wipe out an island! We can run through the barrel to the other side. Yeah, hopefully they'll fire it when we're halfway down. Hey, what happened to Gilder? Huh? Oh, there he is. Sorry about that. Let's get to moving. Hey, where did you go? I just had to take care of something. Hey, don't worry about it. We should get out of this dump. My men are about to attack. Yeah, I agree. The faster we can get out of this place, the better. We still need to find Fina. We can't let her go into uh, Sephiroth wannabe clutches. See, I'm not even going to dignify that jerk with the name. Ha, how's that? Whee! No, it would have been really scary if it started to fire while we were in there. Oh my gosh. Dudes. Look at this. It's so pretty. Oh, it's so cool. Run down this way first to see if there's a chest or an item. Wait, there may be a champ, maybe? No, there wouldn't be any champs because we don't have Fina. Ah, uh, sad thought that is. Ooh, we got the surprise on them. They are yellow. So I think it's green and silver. Why don't I have you go silver? And you go green because you need some more cures. Sweet. Good, good, good. And now the best thing is all it takes is one Cutlass Fury to probably finish this guy off. So, Flyers Bird, if it only takes one Cutlass Fury, why did you attack with the other characters instead of defending? Uh, because he could have defended. And if he defended, then Cutlass Fury may not have been enough to kill him. But the other attacks would have. That's what I'm thinking. I wish they were all that easy. I am so happy right now to be playing this game with you guys again and just just, just so happy that we got that creep off of Ika, you know? Um I'm I'm a very romantic type person in my like philosophies. Uh, I'm someone who believes in chivalry and heraldry. Um you know, doing noble things for other or doing things for a woman because they should be treated like uh, queens and princesses. So, to know that we were able to get that that guy off of Ica, that makes me feel a lot better. So, regardless of what happens for us this episode, I'm gonna be like, yeah, we did something good today, and that makes me happy. Here goes. Oh, that one's defending. Shame. Weblum. So that's Webly except what? Oh. That's the uh, PBAOE blue spell. Okay. Actually, it doesn't hurt very much. Uh, we're going to cut this fury this guy down, and you guys can easily just kill off the guard. Is 
Easy peasy. Yeah, I do want to go back to making sure we learn all red magic, but if I'm being honest, I kind of want to do that with Fina. I wish they were all that easy. In my party too. So taking a break from the red magics to learn the other magics uh, is is not that big of a deal to me. Man, this view is amazing. Uh, there's something there and there's a door there. Should I have gone to the door first? Yeah, we should have gone to the door. Dang it, I hate it when they give you a choice and you don't have the option to go back and pick the other choice. That always drives me crazy. Because now I feel like I missed something important. Oh my goodness, how tall is this elevator? Ah! My men are right on time. Heh, but we're running a little late. They have much bigger cannons. Whoa, look at that firepower. Hey, what about Clara? I'm sure she can hold her own, I think. Man, I'm so annoyed though I didn't get that other door. Ah. Uh. Oh no, they're about to fire the super cannon. Look at that. Look at the size of that artillery. Oh, it backdrafted. That's what Gilder was doing. Oh, you clever. Oh, you are so wonderful. That cannon we went through, it just exploded. The explosion took out that whole area. They won't be putting that fire out anytime soon. Heh, I um left them a little present. Are you two ready? Here's where the real fun begins. You are amazing, Gilder. I like Gilder. Gilder's cool. Can we uh go back and check out that other door now? Oh, we can. Okay, I take back everything I just said about the game not letting you go backwards. A lot of games don't let you do that, though. Like, you know, once you go down that story path, you're kind of stuck on it. Nope, it won't open. The cannon room key won't work either. I guess we need a different key. Really? Ah, uh, we played Silent Hill 3 again. The lock is broken on this door. <laughs> uh, if you don't know the Silent Hill series, and if you don't want to watch the Silent Hill series, because I understand, uh, there's a, like a running thing in the Silent Hill games when you try to open a door and it says the lock is broken. So they have like a ton of doors in the game that don't ever actually open. And that's what that kind of reminded me of. Wow, there's a lot of them. This is a... Uh, uh, this is, um, this is a lot more than I was expecting. Okay, let's cut this fury, the officer, and you guys hit the shock troops. Nice, nice, nice. Absolutely perfect. Okay, so the next round, we should be able to basically duplicate what we did in this round. And providing none of them guard, uh, we should be able to uh, clear them out in two rounds. Okay, that guy's dead. Now the question is, is the officer guarding or not? Because if he's not, he's going to die too. Sweet. I like those little snake designs on their, uh, on their, uh, what do you call those? Shoulder pads? They look really cool. Uh, like almost, uh, what is it? The intertwined snakes. Uh, the intertwined snakes are the, uh, the symbol of Hermes, right? That wasn't so bad. Well, yeah, like I said, it looks really cool. A lot of the little details in this game are really, really nice. Man, we're getting experience, but Fina's not getting any experience. 
I want my Fina back! Where's my Fina? Oh. I mean, th th these whole combats kind of feel empty without Fina next to us. Oh boy. It's a spell that always hits us, but it's a spell that never hits them. Oh, what do you know? As soon as I say that, he missed. That's a first. Although this may actually hurt because this is probably going to all three. Oh, no, it doesn't. Wow, the range on that spell is really small. I mean, Ika is not standing too far away from uh, Gilder there. I guess that's why I never really invested in blue magic. Although, then again, you kind of need to invest in blue magic because you need it to fight other enemies. But I guess if you make up for it by using... Um, so, for example, uh, if you have purple magic or green magic, I don't know how to read this chart that I have down, but I, I guess if you make up for it with other magics, you can um, not use a specific magic. Hey! No hey, the parrot's back! Hey, birdie, how you doing? I love the parrot. The parrot's so great. All right, let's see if there's any um, moonfish. No moonfish? Okay. Let's go ahead and save. Uh, which one are we saving under? The second one. Gotta make sure I don't make that mistake again. Why well, save over the wrong one? Okay, back into the fortress we go, apparently. Oh, this is our Fina. Hi, Fina. I miss you. Dude, I swear, if you touch her, I will destroy you. I'm gonna destroy you anyway, but I'll like double destroy you. I'll resurrect you and then destroy you a second time. Ramirez. Oh, the dots. Ramirez, why? Why are you fighting for the Valuans? What about our orders? What about the elders? Ha! I knew it! I called it! Well, okay. not Maybe not fully. I said he was her brother. I guess maybe he's not her brother, but they're still Sylvites. A lot of dots. Lord Ramirez, it's an emergency. One of our cannons exploded and the entire deck is on fire, but no enemy shells hit that area. Find out the cause of the fire and report back to me. In the meantime, stop firing and set the fortress in defensive mode. There are only two or three ships attacking. Their effect on the wall will be minimal. Yes, sir. I fight for Lord Galcian. That is all that you need to know. Ramirez. Hmm. Really would like to know more. Maybe they are brother and sister. Maybe I did hit that right on the head. Um, we don't know, but we do know that they are knowledgeable of each other. Huh, I can hear someone talking on the other side of this door. Everyone, remain calm. The Grand Fortress isn't about to crumble under the firepower of a few ships. Anyone who deserts his post will have to deal with me personally. Yes, Admiral Ramirez. I will go investigate the cause of the explosion. Two of you stay here and guard the girl. The rest of you, follow me. Yes! Did he just say something? Like, it sounded like he said something, but it was like so short. I had no idea what he said. It sounded like he said, da. So like the German word for yes? I have no idea. All right, so let us get our Fina back. Fina! I'm coming for you. Out of my way. Hey guys, um, you do know that I just like left about 10 of you back on the floor back there. Uh, might be a good idea if you uh, didn't fight. Um, I'm just saying that. It, it could be smart for your careers. Oh boy, he countered. 
Really wish I hit the other guy right now. Yeah. Really wish I hit the other one. That defensive stance is going to make uh, our attacks do a lot less. And he counters, of course. Ah, oh, just poke us. Haha. -ha. Those are really cool, like, uh, little lances, I will admit. Um, let me see. I want to cut this for you, the one with the most HP. And then you guys hit the other one. Who's counting again. It's kind of annoying enemies that just do nothing but counter, by the way. Well, there's one down. By the way, Vice's swords look so cool. I like the green, because you can see, like, the, uh, the top of the blade. Yes! There we go. I thought you would have been alive with, like, one HP. Hi, birdie! No hard feelings. I love the bird. Alright, let's see here. Let's go save our girls, shall we? We found the harbor key in the pocket of the ruined soldier. I wonder if that's for the other door. But for now, it doesn't matter. Fina! We're here for you! Fina, we came to get you out of here. <sighs> Vice. Aww, she's so adorable. We got here as soon as we find out where you were. Are you okay? Yes, Thank I am. Thank you very much. Thank you. Exactly. It's strange. The first time you rescued me from the train, I was really surprised to see you. But this time, I knew that you would come for me. I knew you would find me. Haha. <laughs> <laughs> oh, Fina. After all we've been through together, I swear on my oath as a blue rogue that I will do everything in my power to keep you safe. I know. Oh, she's blushing. Oh. Heh. <laughs> Good one, Vice. I didn't know you were so smooth with the ladies. Getting jealous, Aika? I bet you wish that Vice would say stuff like that to you. I don't need to hear him say those things. I know he would do the same for me. Whenever I'm in trouble, I have faith that Vice will always be there to save me. He already saved me once today. Heh. <laughs> Good point. Can we save the mushy stuff for later? We just broke out of prison and we're still in Valua. All right, but how exactly were you going to get out of here? Well, since we're in the Grand Fortress, there should be Valuan ships docked all over the place. We can borrow one of those. We should be able to reach the docks from the bottom floors of the fortress. We'll have to backtrack a little, but we should be okay. So we'll take the elevator back down and look for a ship. All right, let's go. Fina has rejoined your party! Woohoo! Fina! 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 Okay, I'll stop now. But seriously, I love Fina. Uh, Fina, it's so good to have you back. Thank you so much for returning to us. Uh, by the way, uh, we do have three Moonberries, which is not enough to actually unlock the next skill. I don't want to really spend extra on you. I like your skills. Uh, Vice summons the spirit of an ancient air pirate to defend and counterattack his crew. Creates a mirror-like aura that envelops Ica for one turn and restores 10 MP. Oh. Um. In a long fight, this could be incredibly useful. However, because MP items are really cheap, this isn't super powerful. I mean, you could easily just use one of those items that restore 10 SP or 10 MP. I'm going to hold off on that for now. I would like to see what happens if we get more moonberries. So, let me um well, let me decide later on what skill we're going to get next. I kind of want to get Vice's skill because the ability to counterattack anything for the entire party is very very powerful. But I want to wait to see because Fina's skills are really 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 good and yeah, I mean, I don't need to say anything else. Our skills are really, really, really good. Uh, I don't want you to have red. Um, why don't you have white? Sure, why not? 
And you, Gunsinger, that one. Dude, I'm hoping that he kills both of these. Like, the line hits both of them. Oh, wow. Are you kidding me? Hit all three? How big is that AoE? Holy cow. Gilder. That is insane, dude. No hard feelings. Man, you are a powerhouse. All right, let's, uh, is it this door or the, uh, the next door? I think it was, I think it was this door. Yeah, it was this one. All right, my friends. Well, my name is the Flatless Bird. This is your story based gaming channel. And this is our blind let's play Skies of Arcadia Legends. Uh, thank you for everything. Thank you for your support. Um, I, like I said, I do apologize for not having uh, the episodes out like I have been. Um, I'm going to get back on track. Don't worry. Uh, if there's no episode tomorrow, realize I had nothing to do with uh, my health issues. And I hope my health issues go away. And I hope that everything just returns to normal. Pray for me in that. How's that? <laughs> oh, I love you guys all so very much. Thank you again. And until next time, so long and take care. Thank you for watching this video. Feel free to comment on what you saw and what you would like to see next. I always love to hear your thoughts. Please be sure to like and subscribe for more. Also, please do not forget, you matter. You are brilliant and you are loved. And you should always remember to be true to yourself. Don't let the world tell you any different. Much love to you from your friendly feathered flightless bird. Till next time.